guys, well, it's me here with another video. Today I'm doing a Marvel What If set. What's up with that noise? The Hydra stumbled it basically above the first Captain America movie, the first Avenger movie. What would happen if Captain Steve Roberts never got the serum, but his love interest, Captain Carter, got it instead? Some things are different. I I get like it was the first episode of the What If TV show series one. I kind of like it because I just met the Hydro Stomper. The past was was enough the Tesla. It was the only thing at the time that was powerful enough to power this mech. And see, well, the only person that could lose it, and not taking the only person, but he was the one that lose it and help on our missions. So let's get into the set, shall we? And this one is going to be a bit easier to do than my bigger set ones because it is a bad guy. So there's Red Skull, a classic vein for Captain America or Captain Cotter. Go more detail on the torso and a little bit of leg printing. Good more detail on the back torso. It's like my first first show main fit and I really like it. So I do. It's a cool main fit. So I left the back out of the way. I don't know why he have a red face. I don't know if that was a sport on TV. Don't know if that was a sport ever. Let's get into the captain, shall we? Camera focus. Go more detail on the torso and on the back of the torso, and she has a certain day face, a more happy one. And you can see what she is, is a wee bit different from Captain Mills, who is a Marine, I mean, because she is a British agent, so she decided to wear British. This is our Steph British armor. Oh, well, not that mean for her. There's another version of her in the, the main packs. I don't have that one, so we can do a comparison. But when I do have that one, I do a comparison the two. Oh, well, I like the main feel. And now Steve Rollo with the Tesseract. Sorry, just trying to get the camera focus on the main fair. See what all the light was on the main fair. Classic. Go more detail in the torso, like, not that bad. I like the detail. Same with the back, like, basically having a one to one and four pass. Yeah. Now, I give him the Tesla, I just give him to hold the Tesla. I can like the Tesla, but not many people like this version. CIA in the power bag came with a Tesseract and they prefer that one over the one you get in his set. He has a Sunday face that is also we were happy with the head piece as well. Before we get too far into the video, subscribe and like and leave a comment and help this kind of joke. Thank you very much and bye bye. Now time to get into the main set. Uh, basically a hot bus at the time overall I have to say I like this mech yeah it was one of my favorite mechs in my collection I, this is my third I my mech that is basically a hot bus I have two more you will be seeing reviews of them soon when I don't know before I do this one a little nod, I like this little nod to like the Captain America, like to forgive him when they sit of the Captain America shit. I don't know why they put like oil thing in there, like you feel this thing up with oil. I like the sit like they're not too many sit but they give a lot of detail to the set. This is not a stick oh, this is a pretty detail what I really like. 
I have to say one thing though, the leg cannot hold it up at an angle that you have yeah, you put the thing back too far and you, you got uh, down like the thing is too bat heavy. I like these like tangle things, I really like them though, but they add a wee bit too much weight, like the thing don't have great weight dissolution in the Lego set. But overall, like, I have to say, not like a bad net, you got a good front of pull the B to do. So you do, I kind of like it. I have to say, not a bad set, I would suggest getting it to a wood for your what if collection and if you're into mechs. It's a very good mech for your collection and unique resistance from the what if series, and those are very nice series. There is an Atianar mech. Like Hope Buster in that series, and we actually saw it in a cartoon, like a Lego cartoon. So we did. They were very funny. So was he? He, he can chat from from stuff. So I, I won't tell too much because I don't want to do a review on it. So I do. there's some more of the stickers. And here, where you fit the driver into it, defaults those of course. You don't even have the best protection. I give you that, like the. What I mean is like you have a gun that like, you can easily like headshot him like through I I meant in the show like a wee bit better but Lego version like really not that best for combat like you but then again you mostly gonna do met battle with this thing. And you have two stuff shooter guns. We all know his dust shooters what I'm not gonna shoot down and get them all over my room. I'm not be able to find them. I really don't like stills because you can see I misplaced a still. Right there. Well, I think that everything I have to say with the map is a cool design. I like the green. You don't have many green mechs. I know it's called the Hydro Stomper, but it basically a uh, old Hope Buster. Basically, it's a design of a Hope Buster. Like, you don't think this is an old tiny Hope Buster? There was a Hulk during the war. I guarantee they were called this the Hope Buster because they were losing against the Hulk at some point as well. What? You know, by Hydro Sample. I kind of like it. Oh well, not bad set. I got for a good price. I like the main fears. I got some cool main fears in. You get a restaurant, a cheap set, I feel like. And they come in any other set. Get a cool main fear and have different like, uniform and which are different shares. And you get Steve Otter in his non Captain America uniform. And you get a cool ass beard. Overall, I have to say this that is a cool set. I give it a 10 out of 10. Like I told you people, like, I'm going by set that I give 10 out of 10. So you can't send me here in 10 times. I'm sorry about that. It, and mine says, I know, okay, I bought the set. I love it. The Met, awesome. Me and Fizz, awesome. I got a rest so really like him. Got a cool mech for my collection. Really like that. Like, there's nothing really wrong with it. Besides the uh, bad heaviness. But that does things you have to work with. Like, no matter what, they, that not thing I can do about that. Like, I like these. I don't want to take them off because I was just ruined the set. And who knows if these would even make the thing better. It was the way Lego bit it. It was a bit heavy. But as long as you don't like, touch it too much of an angle, you're probably fine. Or put it too much of a front angle. Like, you can walk these things out. They're not that... It's not a deal breaker. Like, only thing I would give... Like, only deal breakers are the things I would make the things go down. So if I bought the set and then I thought, oh no, that a deal bit of like, if I didn't like the met, that that is a bit deal bit of, I'm I'm running sorry for that. So overall, ten out of ten, proper set. And thank you very much for watching. Hope you subscribe and I hope you leave a comment and please help my channel grow. I know many people say that, but you want to, you want to, you don't, you don't. It's up to you. I don't mind. I don't like many views and knowing that people are watching my views. Good enough for me. So thank you all for watching and bye bye.